LNP with Sunday MP Jason Costigan says he is considering suing for defamation in the wake of the party's move to suspend him over a harassment allegation. The LNP's state executive is meeting on Friday to consider expelling Mr. Costigan from the party after the family of a young woman complained to police and the LNP over the MP's alleged behavior. The party announced on Wednesday night it had suspended his membership as a result of the allegation. Opposition leader Deb Frecklington then revealed on Thursday she had forwarded the matter to police. Ms Frecklington said she demanded swift action from the LNP after receiving the complaint which related to an incident interstate earlier this month. The complaint made against Mr Costigan is serious and it relates to his conduct towards a young woman whilst he was on holidays, she said. The complaint has been investigated by the LNP Disputes Committee. They have found that Mr. Costigan has breached sections of the party constitution that will bring the party into disrepute. Nothing bad happened at an extraordinary press conference on Thursday afternoon, Mr. Costigan admitted meeting the woman but told reporters he did nothing wrong. He said while on holiday interstate he had been invited to stay at a home belonging to the grandparents of the woman at the center of the complaint. I had no shirt on and almost straight away after introducing myself, she didn't expect me to be there and I didn't expect anyone to turn up, I went and put one of my favorite cowboys jerseys on, he said. Nothing bad happened, nothing sinister happened. Yeah, we took some selfies. How many of you people know I love a selfie? I love a photo, you all know that. I, put the old arm around. She didn't look anything, sick, in terms of intimidation, or concern or worry. She was happy as Larry from my recollection. He said he had consulted a defamation lawyer. These are baseless allegations and we will be pursuing the matter through the courts like there is no tomorrow, Mr. Costigan said. The MP then showed reporters photos taken of him and the woman involved. He said he intended to stay on as the member for